It was going to be at a picnic table near the jungle gym right outside the Oval Office. Drinking a chugging a beer, you know, in a playground was not a good image. So it was moved to that location in terms of, you know, sort of what the image is that comes out of this meeting. Uh, they see it as a positive, despite the fact that everyone's Imagine complaining. Imagine that. Imagine right? that. <laughs> and, you know, we kept hitting them. It's like, well, coming out of this, how can you, how can you have a teachable moment if we don't, all we get is this picture? Um, and the White House says, listen, if you go back to when this event first started, this national national controversy and you had said at that point all of these parties are going to sit down at a table together and have a beer at the White House people would have said oh no way that could never happen so they believe that there is a powerful image just by having them sit there at the table even if you can't hear what they're saying yes I recall this idea uh, came forth uh, the second uh, was it the second day after the uh, controversy uh, first uh, the president making a statement secondly saying that he didn't understand what the uh, the surprise was and by the third suggesting recalibrating and perhaps getting together for the beer which apparently they've now consumed any idea about how many they drank <laughs> we don't I mean that is a question that I will certainly ask I mean certainly I don't think anybody wanted to get drunk at that event because that would not have been a good image so I doubt that they were imbibing too much around the table perhaps just one I'll get a count for you though appreciate it Dan and a, a great reporting as always we're just by the way looking at Professor uh, Henry Louis Gates uh, leaving the White House these are live pictures that uh, you're looking at right now as the beer summit uh, is uh, is wrapped up uh, we, and as uh, Dan Lothian reported, uh, hoping that uh, Sergeant James uh, Crowley will uh, step uh, towards uh, microphones and cameras and give uh, a few comments at least uh, to the waiting media uh, to provide further education from what the President and Professor Gates have called a teachable moment. Uh, and uh, we are now told that James Crowley, uh, Sergeant Crowley, has already left the White House. So. That teachable moment uh, turning out to be, well, far more constrained and limited than uh, anyone uh, except perhaps the White House had expected. Dan Lothian, as always, appreciate it reporting from the White House.